What's up, viewers? This is Project Jake Plays, and you're watching episode number two of Project Morrowind Overhauled. And I, uh, I clicked the wrong save. That's fine. It's just a backup one. It just bothers me. But you're watching Morrowind Overhauled episode two in glorious 1080p. The games were meant to be played and viewed, so uh, especially on PC. So we're gonna hop right back in here. And last episode, it was a bit. I was rushing things a little bit. I was just trying to get. The, like first episode of an RPG not boring but uh, today we're gonna take our time a little bit more because we're gonna actually be progressing through the main quest a bit um, it's gonna be more straightforward and more exciting I hope and this loading screen is taking days oh we don't want it to take too long what's going on we make a special trip just for you there we go place. All right, so we left off. There is my character, Seldrin. Seldrin Telvon is actually his full name. Uh, but you don't know that. You just know his name is uh, Seldrin. Uh, and we're going to be ready to go. We're going to be ready to go to Belmur. Uh, I'll stop talking like that. This is the seaport village of Seydanin, Outlander. In the bitter coast, this is a girl. In the bitter coast region, I am a caravaner, and I manage the Silt Strider port here. Tell me your destination if you're looking for a ride, or if you're new to Seydanin, I can help you with local services or any specific place in Seydanin you're looking for. Or if you want someone in particular, maybe I know where to look. Let me, tell, let me hear more about you. I am Darvam Hlerin. Yeah, Hlerin, caravaner. It's when you're playing in a high resolution. These t these words are kind of small, so sorry if I can't read too well. Okay, well, I'm not looking for any other quests. Let's learn more about the Silstriders. Silstriders carry passengers and cargo between settlements in Vardenfell. Forces depend oh fares depend on the distance to be traveled. Silstriders are giant insects. A compartment for passengers and cargo is hollowed from the creature's shell, and the driver directs the beast by directly manipulating the exposed organs and tissues. Silt Striders travel between Altrun, Balmora, Seydanin, Suran, Genesis, Kul, Mulagmar, Margan, and North Landing near Vivek. Vivek. Sorry, also, uh, these, these, uh, Morwind cities, uh, I might butcher a name occasionally. I'm usually pretty good with my Elder Scrolls pronunciation of any culture. I'm a huge nerd when it comes to Elder Scrolls. But, as I've said before, uh, it's gonna look a little bit like I'm a freaking poser or something. Cause let's be honest, n not a whole lot of people are really proficient in Morrowind unless you played it when it came out or a few years after. Uh, I have not dedicated as much time as some other people have to this game. I am just a fan of the Elder Scrolls in general. I'm not pretending to be the most professional and like a Morrowind veteran by any means. Yes, I am interested in taking this to Balmora. If you could please let me do that. Destination, that's what I want to click. Yes. Oh, I gotta hit travel. Duh. Uh, we're gonna go to Balmora. Because <clears throat> from that starter barrel, I got the gold to do it. I kind of feel bad for taking all that gold, actually. That's like a really unfair advantage. Where would you like to go? Where would I like to go? Where would you like to go? I love the faces in this game. I mean, obviously, they're overhauled, but... Alright, so if we look, I almost went off a freaking ledge there. My FPS is dying! Uh, if I didn't mention it last, I think I did, but... Uh, Morrowind is designed to run on, like, a single core. And, uh, when you have a quad-core processor... Uh, no matter what graphics card you have, I have a GTX 1060, as you all know, and it's just... It, it doesn't matter. It's just not well optimized for modern PCs. Which sucks, but we're gonna deal with it. It's not that bad anyway. Um, where am I going? I'm going for... I uh, did that. Yeah, I did that. Oh, okay. South wall. Well, if I look at my map here, I am facing east. And that's the south wall of the city, basically, even though it's kind of open. Um, we're just going to go over here and we're going to talk to somebody about south wall because it's been a tiny little while since I've played through this game. And by that I mean two years. And I've only played the main quest once, so that's freaking great. Hey, why don't you slow down there, buddy? Hey. 
Uh, I know a lot about Morrowind lore, that's okay. South Wall. South Wall is a working class corner club in Balmora, east of Odai River on the south end of Labor Street, owned by Bacola Cla Closius? It's hard to see. Clausius, it's hard to see again. Um, Alright, east of Odai River, so I was right to go that way, so I'm just wasting my freaking time. Because this is the Odai River, by the way. Oh, whoops. That's fine, I'll, I'll slow motion run with, like this for a little while. Um, okay, east of the river. No, there's gonna be a, there's gonna be a sign, because it's a business. Oh, if I remember right, this is actually it. Yeah, it is! South Wall Corner Club. I love Morrowind sounds. Although my sounds and graphics have been overhauled. That's the whole point of Project Morrowind Overhauled. You are not the lady I'm looking for. What say you? You are also not the... Are you the gentleman I'm looking for? No, Caius, that's what I thought. Hurry this up, will you? This is like uh, the Thieves Guild hangout place too, by the way, so... It seems a little... So Thieves much Guild to that's remember. Why. Care to tell me what this is about. Did I? Oh, I get it. Yeah, that's right. I ask anybody in here where he is, and I actually he lives somewhere else. Actually, I remember where he lives, but we still gotta talk to somebody to find out. Why do you approach? No, thank you. Let's just I really this don't, have time don't for this stand song. about. Get moving. Wow. Okay. Caius Cassades. That old sugar tooth. I'm not sure where he's living now, but ask Bacola Clausius, the owner. He'll know. A sugar tooth means uh, they're addicted to, like moon sugar and skooma. If you did not know that, I know what that means. No. You the, uh, the names are so friggin'. Bacola. What's this about? I just saw Bacola. You want something? No, so th she's upstairs. I re I'm remembering a little bit slowly. That's right. She's upstairs. Upstairs. Has no time for you. Hurry this up, will you? It's been a little bit. It's been a little while, but I'm remembering. I'm remembering. Okay, it's a guy. Okay, well, I'm looking for, uh, Caius. Nope. Good day, I'm Bacola Clausius, publican of the South Wall here in Balmora. We rent beds, and I have a limited selection of goods to barter. If you're new here, I can also tell you where to look for other services or a specific place nearby. If you're looking for someone in particular, I'm able to help. I'm looking for someone in particular. No, the Hailu counselors live in Balmora. Okay, that's freaking great. I need to learn about. Oh, there is an option for him. Duh. Old Caius rents a little bed and breakfast just on the hill north side of town. Go out the front door, not the upper door, to the terrace. Then right up the stairs, then left at the top of the stairs, and down to the end of the street. I like Morrowind for this aspect. I do. I have a I have a mod in Skyrim that makes quests a little bit more like this. Get sort of quest markers. It's pretty fun. Uh. North edge of town, out the front door, right up the stairs, left to the top of the stairs, down to the end of the street. Go ahead, stranger. Got it. Not the front door on the terrace, but this, the actual front door. So we're gonna go right up the stairs, left down the street, and are we heading north? That's the wrong button. I am heading north right there. It seems a little dark here. The sounds too, man. Kitty cats. <laughs> Maybe they're Khajiits. That Someone wouldn't be interesting. This is an impression. Yeah, that's his house. What up, bruh? <laughs> you look ripped. Any time now. Uh, what are you talking about? You say your name of Seldrin, and you've been told to report to me and deliver a package. Perhaps you let me look at it? Yes. Yes, very interesting. So, it says here the Emperor wants me to mentor you, and that means you'll be following my orders. Are you ready to trust me and to follow my orders, Seldrin? Package has been removed. Yes. Good. Welcome to the service. Novice Seldrin, you are now a member of the Imperial Blades. 
We are the Emperor's hidden eyes and ears in the provinces. We watch the Emperor's enemies. We look for opportunities. We make reports. And when the Emperor's and when the Emperor commands, we obey. That's freaking great. I know what the blades are. Um I'm the Imperial Spymaster from Morrowind, and since I'm the ranking blade agent in Morrowind, you report to me. Follow my orders, obey our rules, and you'll do fine. You can use my bed if you need to rest. But leave my personal stuff alone unless I say otherwise. If you like, you can improve your modest skills with our blades trainers now. Or if you're in a hurry, I can give you orders right away. But don't forget to visit the blades trainers. I'm gonna actually get trained a bit. Do these blades agents offer training? Not free, of course, but cheap for a fellow agent. Look for Rithlian. Uh, Tire Malin, Nine Toes, and Nine Toes here in Balmora. In Caldera, I'm not going to Caldera right now. Um, Alright, we're going to click each name here. And now we have directions to each one. So... Rithlin... Yeah, we, we don't even need to visit this guy because I'm not a mage. But, uh... We definitely want to see Rithlin, I'm pretty sure. And I'm pretty sure Nine Toes is the Argonian. Um... I'm gonna read this. I I read a lot of books in Elder Scrolls, by the way, so be aware for that. There's his little uh What was that? Freaking drug stash. Yeah, what was that, bro? What was that? You drug it druggy? I'm the I'm the boss of the blades and Imperials in Morrowind, but I'm a freaking drug addict. Okay, um Two houses south of the Kaiser's house upstairs. So Hello. I don't like night. It's spooky. One. This is, I guess, the second house up. Yeah, Rithly. Anything I can do for you? Hello, Red Guard woman. Woman. Um. Yeah, I, I'm. I'm just here for training. Long blade. That's what we need. Forty-one. I'm gonna go up to... I don't know, there's, really, there's no limit. I got the funds. I'm not gonna overdo it. I'm just gonna go to like... 45, I guess. And then I gotta do black. Of course I gotta do black. There's seven. We'll go up to 40 with black. Just gotta get these combat skills up. Um, that was the wrong one. I don't even use medium armor. Dang it, that was a waste of gold. Stupid microscopic fonts. I do like medium armor because... Okay, I, I leveled up, but I have to rest and meditate, obviously. Uh, this The mirror, that's a quest book. Oh, cool. The book put me up to 41 block. Um, so I leveled up, so I gotta rest. Um, I am not gonna read all of this right now. I will... You can pause that, obviously. Feel free to do that, please. I, The Elder Scrolls is such a vastly huge, uh, universe. I got turned around. This is the way. Anyways, I like... I love medium... The sun is rising. I love medium armor because bone mold armor is cool, but long... Or, uh, heavy armor is just the best way to do it. So we're gonna go right back over here towards Caius's house so I can read the journal. Uh, I don't care about him, he's the healer. Nine toes. Uh, face south, go right down the steps, turn left and head south, looking for nine toes door on the left. Okay, so he, out of his house, we'll go down these steps on the right here. What the heck is that? This is some, there's some vegetation that's uh, growing improperly. Head, turn left and look for his house. It doesn't seem to go up any other stairs, so I'm not gonna do that. Nine toes house, that was easy. Alright. Where's the little Argonian? Athletics, that's pretty cool. A hey. oh, I'm stuck. Hey, you're a blades trainer, I know. Illusion, sneak, athletics. Um, I mean, I guess my sneak is horrible. I guess I can push it up a little bit because that's super cheap. Athletics, I'm not going to spend any gold on that, because oh, I leveled up again. Right, I'm just going to go up to 10. Be well, traveler. Thank you. 
nine toes. I need a drink. I can usually do a better voice than that. Be well, traveler. Thank you, nine toes. Okay, these were the steps. So, I've trained a bit. And the sun was not rising. It looks like I was just above the horizon point. Which is weird. I'm going to try and do that again. Unless I was below the horizon point before, and it is super dark here. This is a problem. I can't see for anything. I'm going to rest in his bed to level up anyway. Hello. I'm going to rest here. Uh, I'm going to rest for six hours. You advanced to level two, or ascended. You realize that all your life you have been coasting along as if you were in a dream. Suddenly, facing the trials of the last few days, you come alive. Um, I'm gonna do one for strength. Bas you get three uh, places to gain your attributes. It's very similar to Dungeons and Dragons, actually. Um, agility, no. I'm gonna do endurance. That's really good. I really... I don't know. My long blade is pretty good. I'm going to go with speed right now. I'm going to level up again anyway, so I want to do agility. Yes, Dunmer. Oh, I thought something was about to happen. That's fine. I got to rest again. It's 11 a.m., so I can just take a short little nap and get to level 3. What? Oh, I must have just looped the message when I uh, did another level up. Even though it said to keep meditating, I'm pretty sure that's just what happened. Alright, well, anyway, I did my training. My order, Seldrin, or is there something else you want? First thing, Pilgrim, you're new, and you look it. Here's 200 drakes. Okay, by the way, drakes are uh, what they call their gold coins in Morrowind. Yes, it is the same thing as a septim. Uh, no, it's, it's definitely not anything different. If you think otherwise, I'm sorry. You don't know anything about the Elder Scrolls. Septims have um, Tiberius Septim on the front, the first emperor of Tamriel. And on the back, they have the Imperial logo, which is the dragon, the Skyrim dragon, as a lot of freaking people call it for whatever reason. But it's also the mo uh, logo on the Morrowind cover, and it's the Imperial dragon. And because there's a dragon on the back, they nicknamed them Drakes, because a Drake is also what you call a dragon. Go get yourself a decent weapon, or armor, or a spell. And second thing, you need a cover identity. Around here, freelance adventure is a common profession. Sign on with the Fighters Guild, or Mages Guild, or Imperial Cult. Or Imperial Legion, advance in the ranks, gain skill and experience, or go out on your own. Look for freelance work or trouble. Then, when you're ready, come back, and I'll have orders for you. Alright. So, basically, he wants us to go out and talk to a faction. And, um... Well, okay, here's what we're gonna do. Before we try to join anything, we're just gonna go get some armor. Or, well, we have armor, but we're gonna go see the shop. And if I remember correctly, the shop is down this way. Um... No, I promise you. I, I I pretty much I know I kind of know a little bit where I'm going. It's been a long time, like I said, but I know there's a little shopping district. We're already at 18 minutes, man. I don't want to stop playing this game. Uh, it's over there. I'm pretty sure. Besides this guard. Yeah, there's nothing. There's nothing here. Um, I. I've joined the Fighters Guild. I've never joined the Mages Guild because I don't really play mages in this game. Or I haven't, really. I guess I can't say I do a whole lot in this game, but... Oh, it's up here, right? That's where it is? Yeah, I was right. Okay, uh, this is this is the one we want right here. The shop, the armor place. Um, alright. So I got some pretty good armor. Hello, Meldor. I'm gonna go to barter. Um, okay, so... My Imperial armor is obviously pretty good. 18... We're not going to find any better heavy armor here. Um, there's really... Armor's hammer. Well, I'll buy... How much How much do they weigh? How much do they weigh? Three. I'll buy five. Okay. 
Uh, let's shimmy this down to 105. Hopefully that's good enough for him. Yeah. Um, let's learn about the Fighter's Guild. The Fighter's Guild in Balmora is on Trade Street, west of the river. Down the river is a social report. Look for another thing to join the Fighter's Guild. That's great. I know how to get there, actually. Let's just look at this. Imperial Cult. Balmora's Imperial Cult Shrine is outside of the town to the southeast in Fort Moonmouth. Moonmouth. Eldazi Thyrathron is the priest in charge there. They alter their cures, diseases, and potions, and they offer various services as well. Um, yeah, that's. Hurry this is this not. Up, will you? What? <laughs> Speak, so, traveler. I love the dark elf voices. Dark elves or Dunmer are probably the affairs of wizards are probably my favorite race in Tamriel. Um, that or Khajiit. I really like Khajiit. So I'm going to hit autosave. And I'm going to sneak down. I'm going to take gold. 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 Yeah. Small chest. What do we got in here? Gold. Opening things in Morrowind doesn't actually produce animation, but I have a mod that makes things more animated, which is pretty nice. Uh, what do we got in here? I don't know. I'll take that. Why not? Why not? I'm at, uh... That's level 50 lock. I can't do anything with that. Well, what is my lock picking skill? It's really security, but you know what I mean. Did I make that one... That is a major skill, isn't it? My security level is 30. So I need a little... Uh, it's higher than I remembered it was. I'm still sneaking. I don't want to be sneaking. I will listen, Outlander, but make it quick. It's a quest book. I guess. It updated my journal. Never done that one. Okay, well... We're gonna go to the Fighters Guild, I guess. Actually, you know what? Not even. We're just gonna. We're get... We have to go to the Fighters Guild. Spoiler. For the next quest, we're going to the Fighters Guild to talk to a person. But I'm not gonna join one. I'm just gonna. I'm not gonna join a faction right now. Um, you don't need to be like very proficient in anything or like OP to do the f uh, next dungeon we're gonna go to. So I'm not gonna worry about that right now. Um, I will listen out. I did get turned around. No, I didn't. I sh the other staircase would have been a little bit faster, but... That's fine. We're gonna go back to Caius's house right here. Acrobatics. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Orders. Ready for orders? Good. Go talk to Hasfat Antabalus at the Balmora Fighting... Balmora Fighters Guild. Ask him what he knows about the Neverine secret cult and the Sixth House secret cult. You have to do him a favor first. Probably an ugly favor, but do it. Then get information from Antabolus and report back to me. By the way, Hasfat is a student of Morrowind history. Take the chance to get a little education, and I have a few history books here. Help yourself. You're welcome to them. No point in being part of the history if you're too ignorant to understand it. Yeah! Thanks for the insult, brah. Speak freely, friend. Um, I, I know a good deal already, but... Oh, look! I found one good book here. Moon sugar. Let's, uh... Some lock picks. The lock chest. I'm pretty sure... I'm gonna autosave, and I'm pretty sure that, uh... Even if I pick these locks, he's gonna be upset, so I'm gonna... Alright, auto save. I think I just did that, but whatever. So I get up my lock pick. Lock pick success. Yeah. Not bad. Red. Oh no. Uh uh. Powering up. I'm gonna pick him. Well, we're just gonna hit reload here. <laughs> when in doubt, I love these loading screens, man. You learn so much. Speak freely, friend. 
Dang it. All right, come over here, buddy. Oh, here. Let's let's use. This one. Yo. All right, I know my orders. If you could look the other way, I'd be really happy. Well, we'll just have to get it another time. Steel saber. Yeah, boy. Okay. Um. So we're gonna go to the fighters guild. And I'm fairly certain I remember when that is. It's in my journal anyway. It's in my journal anyway. Um. Yeah, that's the shrine location. Okay, I just asked someone where the fighter skill was, and I th think I remember where it is. It might be in that oh, district. I'm just gonna ask this, ask this guy. Fighters Guild. Trade Street, west of the river, on the right is your head. Yeah, it's on Trade Street. That's where the freaking shops are. I know that. Let's go west of the Odai River. West. That direction is called West. Speak quickly, Outlander, or go away. I love being called Outlander. I really do. Trade Street. What do you want, play, Outlander? I haven't much time. I haven't much time. Freaking weird ass alleyways. All right. Um. So we're on Trade Street. I'm pretty sure is it right here? Yeah, I remember. I had to get a little refresher. But we're gonna talk to Hazfat. I'm pretty sure is the leader. Yes. <coughs> I think she's downstairs. I think it's a woman. It's hard to remember. She's either downstairs or she's definitely upstairs. Or he. This is not it. All these chests are off limits unless I join the Fighters Guild. No? Yeah, there you go. It's a boy. <laughs> I am Hazfat Antabolus, Drillmaster for the Balmora Fighters Guild. So you're with Caius, eh? And Caius wants some information? I'd be happy to help. Though, I will require a favor first. Then I'll tell you what you want to know. Favor. There are Dwemer ruins nearby called Arkingthand. I need you to run over there and find me a little cube with a circular design and some symbols on one side. It's called a Dwemer Puzzle Box. Bring me back the Dwemer Puzzle Box and I'll tell you what you want to know. Um, yeah, I know I know what the Dwemer Puzzle Box is. We're going to ask where this is. Uh, the old Dwemer Ruins Arking Thand are extensive on the surface and underground. Head south out of town past the Silt Strider Port and then cross bridges east over the Odai River. At the signpost, head north towards Caldera. Immediately on the right, see a signpost for Molagmar. Turn right and head uphill on an old road to cross an ancient Dwemer bridge over Foydia Mamera. The entrance to Arkingthand is on the east side of the Foyada, north of the bridge. Turn a crank on a pipe nearby to open the doors. So here we have our first pretty major, uh, first pretty major quest. So we're going to go ahead and end this episode, even though I don't want to, but I'm probably going to record another one right afterward anyways. So, viewers... This was super fun for me. I like playing this game a lot. It's a decently long game, but we're going to do it as uh, straightforward as we can without making it too difficult for us. We're trying not to make it too easy, but I don't know. It's it, We're playing more when in HD. What else can you ask for? So if you like HD PC videos every single day, hit subscribe and come back tomorrow. Thank you so much for the support, viewers. It has been real.